Hi, my name is Jennifer Kwakwasapon. I'm the CEO and a co-founder for Bitty Green Ghana Limited. So Bitty Green produces smokeless charcoal from agro waste, such as coconut husks, coconut shells, palm kernel shells, corn cobs, sawdust, and so many more. This charcoal, we call it the sustainable cooking fuel because it relies on the sustainable supply of the abundant agro waste material, unlike trees, which is limited, and hence the tree cutting for charcoal production depletes our forest. Our charcoal is produced by carbonizing these agro waste material. For example, we carbonize the, co the coconut shells and then we grind it into char dust and then we mix it with a binding agent, preferably starch, and put it into our machines such as these and extrude it into various shapes. Then we dry it and our charcoal is ready to be used for cooking. Thank you. It is amazing to know that the sustainable cooking fuel actually has so many numerous benefits compared to the traditional wood charcoal. Our charcoal, due to the kind of raw material they use, as the coconut shells and the palm kernel shells, has a very high calorific value, which makes the heating of the charcoal really high, the best charcoal you can actually get on the market, and enables the faster cooking. Our charcoal burns three times longer than the wood charcoal, meaning you get to use it for three times value. Our charcoal is also smokeless. There is not going to be any emission of smoke during cooking. Our charcoal can be reused. That is, if you use the charcoal and you probably want to put it out with a little sprinkle of water and dry it, you can use it again. Our charcoal is sustainable. Our charcoal is produced from agro waste materials, waste that choke our gutters. We use it to produce charcoal. Hence, we make sure that we have a sustainable cooking fuel available for all of us as this charcoal is also made affordable. You can buy a kg of BD Green for three Ghana cities. Isn't that amazing? Yes, so this is what we do and this is the benefit that we have for you to definitely switch to using BD Green. I decided to join... Can I start again? I decided to start Beauty Green when at my team in Kenya University campus, we were doing Beauty Green as a community project and it was amazing how we were actually solving a community plight that faced the ban on producing charcoal from tree cutting. We realized this is an impactful project, knowing how much we can achieve impact by making people have a sustainable source of livelihood. That was a, I think I can I start it again? Continue. I should continue. All right, All right cool. I decided to go into BD Green because of the great impact. Yeah. I decided to go into BD Green because of the great impact that it has to deliver. Can I start again? Sorry. Yeah. I decided to go into BD Green because of the great impact that it has to deliver. Looking at how it can sustain our charcoal production and distribution business livelihood in Ghana and across Africa. Looking at how it can sustain our affordable cooking fuel availability across all households and all catering businesses. Looking at how we are making value from agro waste materials, waste that contributes to solid waste mismanagement. This is the impact that I chose to be part of and I applaud everyone that can be part of BD Green to join us and make this impact more meaningful. So my team and I, back on school and Kenya University campus, we started Beauty Green with looking at solving a community plight that faced a ban on tree cutting for producing charcoal. Yes, charcoal production from trees depletes our forest. So with us changing the narrative to producing charcoal to agro waste, we are making sure that these trees that are cut are preserved and hence our forests are protected and preserved. Since we started Beauty Green as the community project, we received help from many organizations. We received help from 4C3 organization. We received help from the Total Ghana Petroleum Company through the Total um, Startup Challenge competition that Beauty Green won in 2019. We've also received help from the Global Youth Advancement Summit where there was a part of an, an sorry, where there was, where a team member presented Beauty Green and won an, a grant amount to push into the Beauty Green business. We've received help from SMV Ghana, from Women's Haven, from SYND, and all these organizations are pushing for Beauty Green to be a great success. And currently, 
Beauty Green has also been selected by the AU Trade and the AU organization to present our products at the AU Trade IATF Trade Fair in South Africa. This help is going to boost Beauty Green internationally and make the products known to the whole world. This business is really capital intensive, but it has great potential. We need a lot of funding to push into it to make the great impact that we can make. As it stands now, there is over 500 million tons of charcoal that is produced annually. And, as, and our production capacity does not even come to 1% of that. So for us to spread the potential of Beauty Green across the country, across the continent, we need all the support we can get so that all charcoal producers and distributors can employ the method of producing charcoal the sustainable way, that is the Beauty Green way. Yes, so I would like to ask for all state organizations, for all other organizations, for all organizations that are looking at protecting our trees, preserving our forests, protecting the climate and supporting youth startups to come and support Beauty Green and let's make the impact that we are looking to achieve a reality in the nearest future. Thank you so much for all your expected help. Hi, my name is Jennifer Kwakwa Sapon. I am the CEO and the co-founder for Beauty Green Ghana Limited. So Beauty Green is the producer of a smokeless charcoal that is produced from agro waste materials as coconut shells, palm kernel shells, sawdust, corn cobs, and so many more. Beauty Green is used just like the normal charcoal, but it has more variety. Sorry, let me start again. Continue. But it has more better features. Beauty Green lasts three times longer than the wood charcoal. It has a higher heat emitting due to the nature of the raw materials we use, which has a very high calorific value. Beauty Green is smokeless. There is not going to be any emission of smoke when you use it for your cooking. Beauty Green is affordable. We have a kg of Beauty Green for three Ghana cities, and this can last you for a minimum of three hours of cooking. So, I decided to enter into doing this business because I realized it has so much, such a great potential. Dealing in Beauty Green looks as protecting our forest, preserving our trees, sustaining the charcoal production and distribution businesses in Ghana and Africa, which is one of the major means of livelihood for many of our locals. I also decided to go into Beauty Green because we can help people that are looking for the affordable cooking fuel to still have a chance to have a cooking fuel for many generations that they can afford to spend on. Beauty Green preserves the forest by using alternative raw materials as agro waste materials mentioned as the coconut shells, palm kernel shells, corn cobs, sawdust and so many more. We received so many help from so many organizations. When we started back on Kenya University campus, we received the help from 4C3, that is the Ford Foundation. We've also received help from Total Petroleum Ghana, where we Beauty Green participated as a participant in the Total Startup Challenge and won in 2019. We've also received help from the Global Youth Advancement Summit at Michigan State. We've also received so much support from SYND Ghana, from SMV Green in Ghana and from Women's Haven Africa. All these organizations are promoting Beauty Green and helping us to achieve the impact that we are looking to set to achieve. We are looking to receive many more state organization help to make sure that there is a reform for us to produce charcoal with the agro waste material, which is more sustainable and it is more safer and a much more clean energy to supply to our households and our catering businesses cooking. So thank you and I look forward to getting all the support from all of us to make Beauty Green the sustainable cooking fuel of the future. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Any parts? Who can start it? Okay, let me start then. Okay. All right. Hi, my name is Jennifer Kwakwa Sapon. I am the CEO and the co founder for Beauty Green Ghana Limited. Beauty Green is the producer of a smokeless charcoal that is produced from agro waste materials as coconut shells, palm kernel shells, corn cobs, sawdust, and so many more agro waste materials. Beauty Green burns three to two, two to three times longer. Can I start again? Continue. Beauty Green burns three times longer than. Beauty Green bed three times longer than the normal wood charcoal. It has a higher heat emitting from the high, high calorific value of the raw material that we use to produce Beauty Green. Beauty Green is smokeless. Beauty Green is affordable. You can get just a kg of Beauty Green for three Ghana cities. 
Bitty Green is sustainable and is produced from agro waste material. We are a farming country with so many farming communities and abundance of agro waste materials contributes to the solid waste mismanagement. So using it to produce charcoal is a both win for us all. We are protecting the forest with the initiative of Bitty Green, making sure that we have charcoal produced from agro waste materials, not from trees. We are also looking at sustaining the livelihoods of many Ghanaians and many Africans that go into the charcoal production and distribution business. We are looking at providing the sustainable um, supply for affordable cooking fuel for all our households that still primarily rely on using charcoal as their main source of cooking fuel, both for household purposes and catering businesses. We received help, we received help from so many organizations, including the Ford Foundation, also from the Total Petroleum Company, from the Global Youth Advancement Summit, from SNV Green Ghana and Netherlands, from also Women's Haven Africa and SYND Ghana. Beauty Green is a sustainable future, is a sustainable cooking fuel for the present and the future. Thank you. Okay, Let's go straight to the point and then we'll listen. Okay. My name is Emmanuel Ben Frimpong and I'm in charge of production at Beauty Green Ghana Limited. At Beauty Green Ghana Limited, we seek to produce, provide um, the Ghanaian market with energy efficient food, um, precisely charcoal. Um, uh, we sought to address the issue with deforestation associate, associated with the local charcoal production. Um, we sought to address this by harnessing the post harvest waste associated with um, agro residue. So then we utilize these waste into our uh, energy efficient and relatively cheaper charcoal for the Ghanaian market. We did this by undergoing a whole lot of processes just to achieve whatever, um, just to achieve our main goal of providing energy efficient and relatively cheaper charcoal for the Ghanaian and international market. Okay, so basically our we, we have a number of machines available here. Our main process is um, we undergo a discontinuous pr production where each process is done at a particular point in time. So then um, our main challenge over here is with regards to um, our... Can I start? Continue. We have issues basically with acquiring raw materials, uh, raw material acquisition Basically, once we are now starting, most of the, our capacity is for using, using of dried waste. And we'd have to go through the various communities to acquire them by ourselves. So then um, we, we haven't had that chance of getting, the, we don't have that easy means of transportation, of transporting the raw materials to our production site. So that's be, become one of our ma major um, um, setbacks. And also, we have issues with um, production um, of the labor. Labor as well. Labor as well has been a major problem. Um, basically, because of our, start, um, our capital, we have a minimal um, capital at hand, and with that, we need to sort a number of things out. And that one w has also affected our production very much because we are unable to get the, n um, the needed, the required number of workers that would work on each of the production line to achieve our mid maximum capacity. As I, as I talk to you now, um, we are able to produce about two tons per day, which is way mini, uh, below our, um, our, capac our production capacity. So with this, we seek to, um, we seek to, hand, we, are, we are looking out for the, um, investors to help us harness the necessary labor, the necessary um, um, production. Okay, within the, within the next five years, we are looking at expanding and we being able to uh, meet more than 50% of the Ghanaian homes um, to provide, to be able to solve that issue of deforestation for the production of local charcoal in the Ghanaian market. We seek to address this, we seek to have um, reduced this 
um, issue drastically within the next five years and also within the next five years we seek to have been able to address all these agro post harvest waste issues associated with the agro products and we seek to have expanded this business to its maximum capacity exporting within the outside Ghana within Africa and outside Africa as well into the European and then international markets. Um, okay, Is it, are you pausing? Okay, so um, we okay we appeal to the Ghanaian markets, the local Ghanaian markets. There are products. It's a very it's a new product though. But um, we we have one one of the major issues we also realized was the fact that the market penetration people accepting our new product has been a challenge and by this we we appeal to the market that once our product coming to them to them they shouldn't see it as an alien product but as just the normal charcoal they've been using in their homes and just to, just give us a try and we assure them of the the quality of our product how efficient it is and how uh, we assure them of that quality and we we do hope that they would come to trust whatever we are giving them the product our product and i don't they will be able to solve these social issues together as a country thank you i'm Emmanuel obin frimpong the production head for bd green ghana limited um, we are a, a charcoal production company. Our sole aim is to keep the, to produce a very um, environmentally friendly charcoal or energy fuel for um, the Ghanaian households. Our main aim for starting this enterprise was to solve the issue of um, post-harvest losses and um, the risk that has been a, a major problem in the Ghanaian communities. Okay, my name is. I am Yimanolo Bin Frimpong. I'm in charge of production at Bidugin Ghana Limited. At Bidugin Ghana Limited, what we seek to do is to provide energy efficient charcoal for our um, local 